Bagel for the yellow one, um, the whole for another bagel, like but for the first one. Hello, this, my name is Ali. I'm here working in uh, Brick Lane for 26 years, like a manager. Uh, Brick Lane actually is keeping changing for uh, quite a long time, and this area it was to be like uh, all Jewish people and all shops and uh, the living and everything. But from uh, 90s to 2000 till now, the thing changing very fast. Used to be Jewish people, then the Asian people taking over all here, we play. Uh, it was a leather business, and now all different nationalities come into big The way it's changed, I would say, is that there's more uh, things, the hipster people coming in. Um, I mean, even the shops have changed. Um, but then they only last about a year and then they close. Um, we also all try to compete with the other shop. We've tried new, new um, um, items and that we've got rainbow labels. That also attracts hipster customers. Actually, it's too much uh, changing in Brick Lane, especially in living places here. Yeah? It's too much development of uh, nice houses. So we got some houses to 1 million to 2 million. And he, he, this is making too much change in Brick Lane. So he, he means it's too many people as well. They're moving to Brick Lane and Bethany Green and Hackney Road and, uh, and uh, Victoria Park. They're coming because he's coming to E1, like he's coming to the city here, you know what I mean? So he getting very, very expensive as well. wouldn't say that um, the gentrification has affected um, sales because um, we still have a lot of um, loyal customers still coming here over the years. In some of them from 30 years, some even maybe even maybe 50 max. They they still talk to us about how they've they've been a lot of customer for that amount of time. There are million and a half to million pound here in Big Lane, and not Big Lane, but just here in Soldier. You know what I mean or not? Me, I was looking for flat for uh, for one month, yeah. So for two bedroom flat, 17, 1800, 2000 pound. So you imagine who's going to rent for £2,000 uh, flat? Normal person? Are you working earning £10 an hour, you want to rent uh, for £2,000? So what, you're going to take your money and put it in a, in a flat? In a house or some flats so of renting is quite good, but in business is very bad. Because too many businesses are open and they close down. Because this is what I said before, is people when they see the two bagel shop they're busy, so people they're thinking, oh, it's too many people, so we can open uh, something. So because it's a movement, so people they're thinking they can open the different business. You know what I mean? But it doesn't work because people they come to bagel, they don't come for to eat sandwiches or whatever. You know what I mean? This is making confusing people. I'm here working for 26 years and I live here. I've just upstairs opposite. I know very good and I meet too many people, too many people who open businesses, even for what sometimes they can stay just one month and they will leave. No even one customer coming inside. You can see too many people in the street, lot of people, but nobody coming in. 